I'm Julius Chambers, and this is part two of Max's Big Bust. With John, Softy, and what's your name again? <laughs> Can I not have a name? <laughs> Nobody. <laughs> <laughs> we'll figure it out later. Let's Tune in for video. Do three. this or do her. Yeah. <laughs> And so last time, where we left off was, we have to choose there to go out tonight. Wait, how do we know what the... Wait. What is... Oh, so the one... So we've got uh, the boardwalk, uh, <laughs> some streets, uh, stay home, we're or the go streets. to the movies. We're working the streets yeah, we're definitely, tonight. Yeah, I, I agree. Nothing bad will happen to us when we're a blonde woman walking along the street. In alone. this outfit. Right. <laughs> With those... A blonde Jeez. woman walking the street in a Swedish <laughs> refugee camp. What ba what could go wrong? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Wow, there's a <clears throat> <laughs> there are a lot of people out here tonight. <laughs> there is one whole lot of people. Looks <laughs> <laughs> like a fifth grader wrote the dialogue. <laughs> He was too busy staring at something. <laughs> see this face? See this face? This is how I feel about this grammar. <laughs> You're aroused by this grammar? <laughs> Max, over here. That's one of those cute outfits you wanted to do in the truck. Yeah, look at that little tummy. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Holly, what are you doing here? <laughs> Aw, what happened to your hair? It's supposed to be screaming. Yeah, <laughs> not like, aww. <laughs> Everything she does is perfect. She's just, of course she's going to be like this. It's every little, like, ah! <laughs> every little thing she does is magic. Yeah, everything every just thing turns, she turns into... Oh! <laughs> <All right. laughs> <laughs> what happened to your hair? So we should, we should, we should put in the same. Wilhelm scream there. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> all right, yeah. I cut it? No. It was so pretty. It was also super annoying. I don't care. <laughs> it's going to take years to grow it that long again. Gargle some like a cheese whiz to produce that noise. Just sound like just sound like a Merla. All right. Well, I can't do the cheese thing, so <laughs> continue. <laughs> Dave, get me some cheese whiz. Uh, <laughs> luckily, you're still <clears throat> super cute with short hair, but it's not the same. Oh, calm down. It's not the end of the world. Frickin' drama queen. <laughs> Wait, are those your casual clothes? Look at that side boob. <laughs> For some <laughs> casual... Casual intimacy, rock. some casual racism. <laughs> <laughs> Please tell me there's been a horrible mix-up, and those aren't your casual clothes. You slanty head freak. <laughs> <laughs> casual racism. <laughs> what? They're comfy. Mm, I'm going to have to take you shopping with me at some point. That just doesn't cut it. Like your hair. Like the low cut in my shirt. <laughs> Is this woman supposed to be a professional detective or something? She, uh, we're She's professionally working the streets. <laughs> Detecting She's professional whore. Things. <laughs> you're not gonna make me wear a dress. You're gonna... You're... <laughs> you're I want that boy! <laughs> you're not going to make me wear a dress. I refuse. You say that now. So what's all the commotion about? <laughs> Yeah, clearly. <laughs> <There's> <laughs> lots of commotion. What's with all the peoples is on the street? <laughs> oh, get ready to pronounce that. Volume 12 of, of Oregon. I can do this if you want. <laughs> is launching at midnight tonight. I think tonight. it's pronounced, oh, I'm a uh, wishindari. It's pronounced, uh, <laughs> sorry, watch <you> go, yo. <laughs> The anticipation is killing me. I became a mermaid. What? She knows... Oh, you speak <laughs> Japanese? <laughs> yep, I'm bilingual. <laughs> That's so cool. <laughs> eh, it's nothing special. <laughs> I own the complete anime series of the aforementioned series. 
on Blu-ray. I've read every volume of the manga, and I've even bought every single figurine they've released, including the ones that come in blind bags. That was the Asian half speaking there. <laughs> anyway. I spent, like, $300 trying to get that gold Narita figurine. Isn't that the airport in Tokyo? Uh, you don't know. I guess we're not gonna fact check that. Let me check Google. I've got so many doubles right now. Instead of singles, it'd be so much easier if you could just buy the damn things individually. But no, they've got to rip off all their fans. You're getting some insight here into the struggle of being an anime fan trying to get merchandise. Merch, <laughs> merch, bro. God, so merchandise. So what's yeah. what's the series about? <clears throat> Oh, you know, turning into a mermaid. It's just your typical guy gets turned into a mermaid <laughs> story. But the characters are so deep and well written, there's heaps of drama, and every second page is a sexy cleavage Wait, shot. You mean like every single graphic in this entire game? By the way, I'm a chick, remember? <laughs> Continue. <laughs> Ooh, hi. It's pretty much the best manga ever made. Would I like it? Duh, of course you would. Everyone <laughs> loves cleavage shots. <laughs> Good point. She still thinks like a dude. Quick, cut in and you can buy the whole series. They're on sale to promote the new volume. Cut in. What are you talking about? Cut into the store. Like cut the line. Yeah. At this point, I don't even remember what Max looked like as a man. <laughs> it's not really relevant. <laughs> are you sure it's okay to just cut in line like that? Yeah, you're a totally hot chick now. You can do whatever you want. You can't even go to jail for doing anything. <laughs> what? Aww. Uh, <laughs> girl. What, she's not significant enough to get a name? Yeah, she's just a pure objectified essence. Dave. She's just the essence of objectivity. I mean, could, just look at that outfit. They could have said piece of meat and it would be the same thing. <laughs> it looks like she has kind of a big gut, but it's being held. She's like stripping, too. Look at her hand. Really tight bustier. <laughs> she has nothing on the back side. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's... This is, this look at that, that thumb down the strap. This is girl. Is she wearing a mask? She's wearing like an eye patch. <laughs> she doesn't have any animal parts grafted to her body. She's racy the pirate. <clears throat> hey... Yeah, that was a lot I of think that's up. hey, you're cutting in line. Okay. Do it right. No, 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 no. It's hey, hey, Lisa, <laughs> hey, Lisa. Even okay. when I'm angry, I'm soothing. What did she have to say? Uh, I'll give you a Silichon figure if you if you pretend you didn't see anything. I don't know how to see these. What? Those are so rare. I own like 10 of them. <laughs> They're all busts, you know, <laughs> stupid blind bags. I spent the rest of the evening hanging out with Holly, and I even scored a, few, a new book series to read. Mm. Ooh, I should check my phone before bed. I listen to those crickets. What? <laughs> Her Tinder's like blowing up. Should we read that? Yes, we should read that, actually. Remember this. What did it say? The sound of gunfire filled the air today as the Axon City Police Department raided a drug ring operating out of the Lacastro Transportation Bus Depot. Hey, I did that! <laughs> nice. Contacts. Uh, oh, games. Uh, uh. Crap, I need to get to the keyboard. <laughs> Shh. Call it. The egg hatch. Call it. Name your naughty little pet something. <laughs> Ooh, an, an, a reference to another anime within an anime. Anime assumption. It's meta. <laughs> Whoa. What? Okay, you know what? We'll do this on our own time. <laughs> Heart. What is. Oh, so awkward. We have the least amount of hearts with Holly. Is this is like a dating app? No, this is just like your... Friend level. Is that like the friend zone? Apparently. Mm. Buddies with Brad. Oh, I thought that Amber. was the male version of us at the top. How can we be friends with ourselves? 
well, we're, we know ourselves pretty well. Except and no one actually likes themselves. Jeez. Yeah, John. Wait, who is the middle one for the captain when we start wooing him? No. Oh. The captain's married and has a kid. <laughs> oh, wait, really? Yeah. Oh. You mean a kitten? Huh? Yeah. <laughs> well, I don't... Okay, I just wanted to go see Max go to bed. <laughs> <laughs> well, that was quick. And was the hair short. grew back. Uh, yep, I'm still a girl. God damn it. I was really hoping this was all some weird messed up dream. How did all the hair grow back? Mm. I think Wait a minute. Afraid. I cut my hair last night. Why the hell is it long again? What the fuck? <laughs> did, did I not actually cut it last night? I swore I did though. I can remember it clearly. I was in the bathroom. I had these big pointy scissors as opposed to like That's round <laughs> scissors. Yeah. <laughs> it took ages to get all that hair out of the bathtub. It was a nightmare. Those were her nipples, actually. The pointy things. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck is going on? Well, language, girl. I raced to the bathroom, and sure enough, there were still telltale signs of my haircut massacre from last night. Long blonde hair still clogged the drain. Ugh. <laughs> and the scissors were still sitting in the sink where I left them. I definitely cut my hair here. Maybe it was a different area of hair. Did my hair go back overnight? What? How does that work? Not only am I stuck as a chick, but I've got magic regrowing hair now? How the fuck does that make any sense? Seriously, what the hell did that gemstone thing do to me? This is making even less and less sense by the second. This isn't right. This isn't right at all. The one thing I've never understood is... Is that a poster... Of a bridge under her window? <laughs> yeah, or... gonna... yeah, like the books up there too. That looks like the whole collection of Harvard Business Review. <laughs> and this doesn't seem like a guy or girl who would do that type of reading. <laughs> <laughs> now, can Max even read? <laughs> Are we? We're, we're we're in our own room, right? This isn't like a hotel because this just looks like a hotel room, honestly. No, it's probably an apartment. I mean, yeah. yeah. She probably just goes in and out of guys' beds. <laughs> <laughs> She's only been a woman for one day. <laughs> <laughs> She's already catching on. <laughs> Instant hair oh, growth man. products have been on the market for over three years now. And there are even a few super expensive gender swap drugs out there now. Stuff like this wasn't completely unheard of nowadays. <laughs> nice. Yeah, it sure isn't. <laughs> <laughs> There's still a perfectly logical scientific explanation for all of this. But I was completely clueless as to what it could be right it's now. It's called the Rothschild family. <laughs> <laughs> It's the Roth IRA. Yeah. I definitely never heard of something like this happening before. That was for bloody shit. <laughs> this is strange, but hair going back overnight is no different to turning into a girl in 15 seconds. Quick, time the cutscene! <laughs> There's probably just residual traces of whatever is that vivid in that gem still in my bloodstream, that's all. That's okay. I can handle this. I'll just cut my hair again. Victoria's bound to have a cure by now anyways. I just need to make t make it to work and then my life will be back to normal. At least, I hope she found a cure. Now, where did I put those scissors? <laughs> After cutting my hair for the second time in 12 hours, I got in my car and made my way to work. I wasn't looking forward to today, but I had to show my face in public sooner or later, and there's really no getting around it. Morning, Max. Hey, Holly. Hey, Amber. She still got the work. comfy clothes on? Jeez. I'm still annoyed about the hair thing. Thanks, me. Why? She looks cute. <laughs> Don't get too upset. It might come back after all. Huh? D Don't worry about it. Is Victoria in yet? My yeah, gosh, she's already downstairs. Alright, it's time for me to turn back to normal. I wouldn't count on that. <laughs> wow. Hey Victoria, did you find a way to turn me back to normal yet? Um... Like, and now... Damn it! 
And did you get a haircut? Two, actually. You look hot, but I think I prefer you with the the Richard Nixon look. <laughs> <laughs> I prefer you with long hair. Richard Nixon look? <laughs> <laughs> what are you talking about? You I prefer you stressed out hair. and stormy looking. Well, it'll probably go back by tomorrow. That seems fair. Huh. I cut my hair before I went to bed last night, but when I woke up, it had all grown back. That's weird. I know, right? <laughs> Whatever chemical that transformed me would still be floating around in my bloodstream or something. That's probably why the serum he gave me yesterday didn't work. Are you sure you're not related to Bob Ross? That pubic <laughs> mug <laughs> puffs up every night. Pubic <laughs> mug. <laughs> <laughs> it isn't? <laughs> it overfloweth. <laughs> <laughs> nope, not in the slightest. And if what you're saying about your hair is true... So, basically, I'm stuck like this for the time being? I'm going to run an analysis on the gem, but for the meantime, you're stuck as a woman. For you. Like you. Yeah, damn it, baby! Go totally crazy. Feel like a lady. <laughs> I'm running some handwriting recognition software on some script I found on the underside of the gem, and it should be finished in a few minutes. Maybe that'll give me some ideas as to what the hell actually happened to you. But in the meantime, go on RuPaul's Drag Race. Now, <laughs> you can try on your new uniform. The express delivery arrived this morning. Uh, I was dread I was dreading this. Don't worry, you've got a great figure. You look gorgeous in it. <laughs> Kiss my ass. <laughs> I'm a man. I'm not supposed to look gorgeous. Well, you would look great if a man slammed you into a table. <laughs> <laughs> oh my. Stop complaining and put your clothes on. Hashtag me too. <laughs> I wasn't happy, but it wasn't like I could keep walking around in a pair of pants that kept falling off. Tighten your belt! <laughs> <laughs> and as reluctant as I was to wear a bra, it would be nice to stop those uncontrollable <laughs> boob bouncing. Is that how they work? I'm not so sure. It's like a trampoline. She's in the constant trampoline. Hell, if I tried running after a perv, I'd probably knock myself unconscious with these puppies. <laughs> oh, these yeah. Puppies. <laughs> Those little hush puppies. Gumby in the chest. <laughs> <laughs> Why couldn't I have been turned to a girl with smaller breasts? It would have made things so much easier. <laughs> Max, are you coming out of the closet? <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to. My friends will make fun of me. <laughs> It looks like the, her breast is just completely eating away her shoulder. <laughs> <laughs> it's like... Her, her shoulder is like dislocated into her chest. <laughs> oh. Her left breast looks grotesque. Look at that. that. Oh. Oh, the imbalance in that shot is repulsive. Oh my god. I'm gonna need to use chemistry balancing equations to balance these jugs. No. Yeah. It, can't be, it can't be any more embarrassing than anything else, can it? You were walking around without a bra five minutes ago. Unless you have a penis, come out. <laughs> I feel so silly. Whoa. <laughs> and this like porno music is playing. <laughs> <laughs> uh, wait, is she wearing a tie that like only it's goes like down to like the, the stubbiest little tie uh, ever? No, yeah. it keeps going. Oh, it's just like the shadow. Oh yeah, oh, yeah, yeah you're some right. Interesting lighting it's choices. Very weird. The lighting is just like yeah, it's the disco ball or whatever. Oh yeah, they do have a disco ball in there, <laughs> if you remember from last episode. That'll look weird if she put something in those pouches, on the, in the shirt. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Pouches? You mean pockets? <laughs> Whatever the hell there's no, way, there's no way you're putting anything in there, uh, that's for sure. Don't tell Holly about this, okay? It might be a bit light for that. Oh my god. <laughs> I think that man is gay. <laughs> Where's my phone? I need to take pictures <laughs> and immortalize this moment forever. I think this is what you call harassment in the workplace. <laughs> yeah. Call the cops. Oh, wait. <laughs> 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 
Why? I'm wearing the exact same thing you are. It's not the same, and you know it. Oh. Actually, it is the same. <laughs> yeah, it looks, yeah, you're right. Pretty much the same. Mr. Weinstein, uh, get in there. Yeah. Wait a minute. Victoria, why'd you order me the skirt instead of the pants? You said you were going to order me pants. I held Victoria at gunpoint and forced her to click the skirt option. Oh. <laughs> it's a mosquito. That's a cute way of saying it. You're kidding, <laughs> right? Sounds like armed robbery. Yeah, aw, oh, that was so thoughtful. She's not. <laughs> Why the hell do my breasts look so freaking big in this top? Because they're just. They are just that big, Max. Maxine, should I say? It's impact resistant <laughs> padding to reduce injury in fist fights. You mean just like body fat? Like. <laughs> mammary tissue? <laughs> yeah, what would it feel like to get punched in the breast? I've like heard it hurts. I feel like it would hurt. Like being punched in the crotch. Yeah, something like that. <laughs> Maybe, I don't know. Impact resisting padding is the best thing ever. Max, do a sexy pose. <laughs> what? Paints me like one of your French girls. <laughs> this is uh, such harassment. No. Touch your boobs and moan in pleasure. <laughs> what the? Like ah! <laughs> How do these people get anything done? <laughs> I'm definitely doing that. I mean, not doing that. <laughs> what the hell is this? If they have a penis, they might as well just jerk off in a potted pan like Harvey Weinstein. <laughs> <laughs> uh, at least smile Bring at me the my camera. hibiscus. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Mr. Weinstein, I brought in your, your hibiscus today. <laughs> oh great, another plant. <laughs> 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 uh, yeah, I said the line. <laughs> oh. I was too busy doing Richard Nixon. <laughs> 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 Fine. You happy now? Was that oh, Richard Nixon strong. bringing his motorboat out <laughs> <laughs> on the lake? Yeah. yeah. No, I demand more sexy. Aren't there like criminals to catch or something? Like <laughs> Holla, what did I say about harassing mercs? Ah, <laughs> uh, I'm sorry. The one on the left is kind of a tranny or something. <laughs> <laughs> You're going to get a sexual harassment complaint if you keep this up. Leave her be. <laughs> yeah, hashtag me too. <laughs> she hasn't turned into a man yet. <laughs> but, but, if you stop harassing her, I'll take you to the coffee shrine and put your head in. Then you can look at the <laughs> cute fox girls in their sexy shrine maiden outfits. I do like fox girls. Wait, wait, so does this, <laughs> this woman like women or men? I don't know or what she is. If you haven't caught on, she's gay as hell. Well, <laughs> she's genderless. How have you not noticed that? No, I don't, I don't know if it was just like, oh, whatever. No, I mean, her hair isn't that dyed. <laughs> <laughs> it's gender fluid. Well, she is also a weeb, though, isn't she? I don't know what she is. She is a weeb. That'll be all for now, Max. That'll do, pig. That'll do. <laughs> Sorry about her, she's a little bit uncontrollable. When it comes to cute girls. <laughs> yeah, that's why they hired that dyke to be a partner. <laughs> I'm not a cute girl. I'm a cute guy. I identify as an attack helicopter. <laughs> if you're done blushing, the result of the analysis at the back, <laughs> your check. Woo! <laughs> 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 Victoria moved the program to her main monitor. Yes, multiple monitor speaks Yo. to my IT nerd. <laughs> Is that a window? Is that like a reflection? It was like... I think it's just was... a picture of a bridge. <laughs> is, is that a picture of the office? Like, <laughs> anyways. It looks like it's just a bunch of iPads and like a bunch of other random shit. Instantly went into nerd mode. Her fingers flying across my genit- I mean the keyboard <laughs> in a mad flurry. <laughs> this girl clearly spent way too much time down there between my legs. Down <laughs> there. <laughs> but she knew what she was doing. Watching her typing like that was almost hypnotic. <laughs> Uh, what the fuck? <laughs> facial expression. Looks <laughs> like she's been plowed from behind. Yeah, so that's the wrong oh. whole face. <laughs> <laughs> How are you both thinking that? <laughs> Great minds think alike. Yeah. This doesn't oh, make any sense. 
What does it? That fancy marble you found, it looks cool and all, but if you look on the underside, it has heaps of writing <laughs> in a language I don't recognize. It must be Hebrew. <laughs> this is from Mordor. I thought it was Arabic. Well, I don't know what she said. <laughs> Do you be touching that? Why are you touching that and not me? <laughs> it's fine. I've examined it multiple times, and there's absolutely no trace of any transformation transformation elements. Whatever it is, it's completely inact inactive now. Now that I look at it, all that swirling electricity is gone. <laughs> so, assuming this isn't some elaborate prank, the writing on the underside appears to be written in some sort of cryptic code. According to the computer program, it doesn't match any language on Earth, <laughs> including ancient... No, she just said it was Arabic. <laughs> <laughs> no, she didn't. He just inserted that. No, no, uh, no, no it did say something about Arabic, but I, I think... Her Those initial Arabs. her initial assumption was that it was Arabic, but it wasn't actually. <laughs> oh. It ain't those sand niggas writing on a marble. <laughs> <laughs> Did I say that. <laughs> he did. Whatever. We'll edit it later. He's not gonna get edited out. That <laughs> ship has sailed. <laughs> Let's keep that. <laughs> I think someone is just messing with us. Some nerd with a hobby kit in a basement somewhere. Probably just thought it'd be funny to mess with the police and swap their genders for kicks. Yeah. Yeah, because that happens. It's just a prank, bro! <laughs> wow, this nerd in a basement thinks someone else is going on, but I don't know what it is just yet. Your magically regrown hair just complicates things even further. Let me know if anything comes up, okay? No problem, girl Max. I'm on the case. Girl to the max. Don't don't call me that. So she's gonna like put all of her time and effort into solving his gender problem instead of actually working on cases and things that are relevant. If they just busted yes. this huge shipment of like that illegal drug and they're just yeah, like, like oh, screw it. We're gonna <laughs> yeah. Everybody has the week off. We're gonna pay attention <laughs> to these tits. See if we can trick them. Background research wasn't really my speciality. Specialty. Speciality. Your reality? My reality. Yeah. Monica's only my real <laughs> I was more of a hands-on kind of investigator. Hands on my own tits! <laughs> I decided to leave Victoria in her element and see if there was anything to do upstairs. Hey, buddy. Looks like you got a new look going today. His look is just the perverted champ counselor look. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, they're making me wear a woman's uniform. Hilo went completely ballistic. She's got a way of doing that. She has such a way with words. <laughs> you better not be planning on spending our entire shift making fun of me, alright? I've had enough of that for one day. Oh. I'm not going to mock you. This wasn't your fault or anything like that. If you hadn't opened that crate, I would have, and then I'd be the one. There's a woman! It would have made my life easier, that's for sure. Yeah, you can suck it, Brad. <laughs> <laughs> you wouldn't catch me wearing a skirt. I know that much. I already caught you wearing a skirt last week. I prefer skirts. Blame Holly, she's the one who ordered this thing. Don't worry about it, Max. You actually look pretty professional like this. I respect <laughs> women! The short hair suits you too, We deserve bro. equal pay, for sure. <laughs> there is no wage gap, after all. Yeah, I, I look at that and I say, yeah, that's a professional. <laughs> <laughs> Sleeves are rolled up, ready to do some work. <laughs> no, no one's gonna take me seriously at all. I mean, we aren't, and we're not even, like, you're not even real, but like, whatever. <laughs> What? Are you kidding? Of course they will. You don't need no man. The perps don't know you used to be a guy. <laughs> They'll just see a chick with a badass shotgun pointed in their face. They'll still be cropping their pants when you electrocute them. <laughs> what is it, an electrocution like device or shotgun? <laughs> it's like a stun shotgun thing. <laughs> oh, I see. I, I guess that's true. I'm about to step out and grab some coffee for everyone. You should come pick it up with me. Getting out of the station will do you good. Trust me. 
Trust me, it helped last time I was a Trust. woman. Trust. <laughs> what if I see people I know at coffee shrine? I'd die from embarrassment. No one's gonna recognize you. Trust me, you look like a completely different person. <laughs> yeah. That's actually a pretty good point. You can just tell people you have a new partner and no one will be the wiser. A partner with the same name. <laughs> huh, this might not be so bad after all. See, everything's gonna be fine. Things weren't ideal, but I was feeling a bit more relaxed. Being a woman wasn't the end of the world, and I was being forced to... <laughs> I was just being forced to look at things from a new perspective. I can still vote. <laughs> as long as this is only temporary, I'd be fine. A little bit humiliated, but fine. <laughs> I'd probably fit in these shrine maiden outfits now. Hollywood totally freak if I did that. I'm sure that could be arranged. Shut up, Brad! <laughs> Shut up, Brad! <laughs> I wouldn't be caught dead in one of those. They are pretty impractical. Brad's fly is really tight. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is me, right? You're Marking my work uniforms, are you? hot. <laughs> like, go to this club and see this hot chick with this. Hey, ears. I never said impractical clothing was a bad thing. You know, I think these outfits look good. <laughs> That face on that waitress, man. <laughs> that says it all. <laughs> Damn right they are! Oh, hey Max! <laughs> <laughs> Did you lose a bet or are you just trying out a new gender for fun? That's what all the kids are doing these days, trying out a new gender for fun. <laughs> oh, you can recognize me? Max, I run a business that specializes in turning guys <laughs> into cute fox girls in order to sell coffee. She's like I'm a transsexual madam. good at spotting <laughs> stuff like this. Wait, why do they have to turn guys into what? cute fox girls? What? She all the girls who used to be guys? <laughs> <laughs> well, not all of them. <laughs> so many guys jump at the opportunity to work a coffee shrine. Thinking they'll be surrounded by hot women all day. They almost never read the fine print. Oh, <laughs> oh, oh, <laughs> so oh, 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 oh god. god. Horrible. In Asia, that's what they call a based lady boy. <laughs> yeah. Those poor busty fools. So, Riley, which waitresses used to be guys? <laughs> that's a company secret. <laughs> Tostitos has their trademark. These guys have theirs. <laughs> yeah. I don't know how I feel about that. So, why are you a girl, Maxine? It's a long story. Basically, I touched something at a crime <laughs> scene I shouldn't have. Yeah, Max and now OJ's walking free. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Ma Max needs a uh, drag name. <laughs> like RuPaul gave Elton John some sort of yeah. drag name. Yeah. It should at least be Maxine or maybe RuPaul. Uh, <laughs> we can't talk too much about an ongoing investigation, but we're looking into it. And the, and at the moment, we don't have a way to get Max back to uh, I'm gonna check out. I'm gonna, I gotta go to bed early. Alright, they get up early. We should stop that. We do after. Okay, this is where we're stopping for tonight because John's a pussy. <laughs> you guys can keep playing. I don't, I don't even think I have John, if your lines come up, it's going to be horrible. Thank you and good night. Tune in next time for more of Max's Double D Guarantee. Arigato.